the very notion of order disappears. Chaos comes back, and anything is permitted. Men disguise themselves as women, gentlemen as knaves, and the poor as rich. People shed themselves with their dignified expressions and conservative clothes that isolate them, dress up in gaudy colors, hide behind a mask, and escape from themselves. Buongiorno and good day, friends and citizens. We are Comedia of the, of the Seven, Seven Seas. Seas. Hey! Comedia dell'arte is comedy of the artists. We humble players in the streets of Italy firmly believe he who walks this street without a sigh is a happy man. And it's in this spirit that we greet you all today. We grace you with our presence to regale to you a tale of seduction. A tale of obsession! A tale of digestion! Yes, the streets of Italy are paved with love. Love of the art! Love of love! And love of linguine. And this love of fine Italian pasta is the love around which our story revolves. Gather round one and all as we, Commedia of the Seven Seas, present to you... The, the Hunger, Hunger for Gabriella de Gnocchi! Gabriella's hand was promised to the son of a chef in a neighboring town, Antonio Boyardi, who was doing amazing things with ketchup and beef breaks. But even his proclivity in the kitchen was no match for his love, Gabriella. None in town were more familiar with Gabriella's culinary skills than that of Mayor Starvino de Plenty. His desire for her angel hair was only outweighed by his desire for her penes. He was determined to be her manicotti. He called to his servant, Kino! A loyal little devil, Kino, was tasked with fulfilling whatever the mayor demanded, though often to the mayor's demeaning. Kino, the day Gabriella is to be wed. Oh, congratulations to her! There will be no congratulating her until she is married to me. Wait, but how will she be married to you if she's married to the son of the great Chef Boyardi? She will not be married to the son of the great Chef Boyardi. I have a plan. My love, today we wed. For my life was not complete until I gazed upon your beauty. Never before did I dream I'd meet a love whose fairness could rival my own. Rivals revealing the ravioli of our love. At last, my heart is full, just as your tummy will be for the rest of your days. You can shower me in your shells and cheese tomorrow. For tonight, my father, the great Chef Boyardi, shall feed our wedding guests. Thank goodness for Chef Boyardi. My love and I were just discussing you. Our wedding guests shall swoon for your succulent sauce at supper. Ah, oh, yes, spaghetti, ravioli, you're talking to Prince Gabriel and his eye! Kino? Yeah. <laughs> I say, oh, what is the meaning of this? Oh, my love, this is Kino, attendant to Mayor de Plenty. Oh, I see. I trust you've come to give your congratulations on our wedding? Ah, uh, not quite. I've come to warn you! To warn us? About the mayor! About, about the, the mayor? mayor. Well, Gabriella's fairness, but also her farfalle. Who has his eyes set back on Gabriella? Dilly dally. Of course. But well, why did you come bearing the likeness of my father, the great chef Boyardi? That was the mayor's doing. He has ordered me to disguise myself as your father and to sprinkle sleeping powder into your wedding dinner so that you will fall into a deep sleep and he can run away with your bride. Oh, oh no! no. <laughs> Indeed, he probably doesn't even manicure his cuticles. And his manners! Ah, forsooth, leaving clouds of flatulence in his wake wherever he goes. And that face! Oh, what a poor horse! How often he must have been dropped on his face as a youngling, because he's ugly! I think we get the point. May we proceed, please? I've got it! Got what? The way out of Mayor Starvino to put his clutches! And what cruel clutches they are! What is your plan, Gabriella? The mayor thinks he can be triumphant by putting you in a disguise. Well, we'll give him a taste of his own medicine. <laughs> and so Gabriella devised a scheme to convince the mayor that if he were to marry a fine Italian chef, his health would be put in jeopardy. But given his desire for Gabriella's goods, would it work? Oh yes, I thank you for coming into this. 
doctor and surprising me so quickly, ma'am. Oh, yes, well, I'm a very important man with much to do. What is this pertaining to? Ah, uh, yes, you see some alarming numbers have come back on your most recent checkup, so I wanted to follow up with some uh, double checking. Now, open up, say, ah! Uh, Oh, no, no, Mr. Mayor, let us not let the 
plenty was not awake. To bid those kids farewell and cut the cake. And though he slept as though he were dead. He never woke to see the lovers wed. And now we must hit the seven seas. Grant us your hands, oh pretty please. And though we know you just love us best of all, do you enjoy the seven seas? Food, food festival!